What's up, people? Hunts Love Riders here. And just giving you a little quick little update on the status of the old 1999 two-door Chevrolet Tahoe. Um, I haven't really been driving it, man. I have not really been driving it much lately. And I'll explain to you why. Um, I've been, well, this is one of the reasons. One of the reasons why I haven't been driving it a lot is because I've had problems with the doors, the door panels inside. Hello? Hello? Anyway, I'll dance that phone real quick, sorry. Here's the thing, the door handles. Let me show you what's going on in here. As you see, I already did the driver's side. The driver's side is back on, but ever since I took possession of this vehicle, the inside door handle was broken. So you couldn't open it from the inside. You had to roll the window down and open it from the outside or have somebody open it for you. So I'll get back to that in a second. The driver's side recently had the lock mechanism had broke on the driver's side to where it was locked and it wouldn't come unlocked. Once I took the door panel apart, I realized that somebody on the door handle itself, instead of putting it done, doing it the right way, they put a screw in there and the screw had came loose and fell out. And that's why the lock mechanism wouldn't lock and unlock like it was supposed to. So once I got that bootleg screw out of there, put a rivet back in there like it's supposed to be, uh, I was able to use the same old door handle. Now on this side, the handle itself was broken this piece right here, which is kind of odd because it's a metal piece, a kind of cast metal. I don't know what kind of, very cheaply made at that, but this part was broken. So I need a new handle. Well, I remember when I first got, took possession of this vehicle, I started searching the vehicle and I remember inside there was my younger brother had already had bought a brand new handle for this side and two brand new handles for the outside uh but he only put he made he put the one he broke the handle on the outside i remember and what happens is he ordered this handle when he ordered it, he ordered the wrong one, so he had to order the other handle because he he uh, he broke the outside handle on the driver's side. He replaced the outside handle on the driver's side, but still had the passenger side. So I got brand new passenger side handle uh, just in case that one ever had problems with that one. But he had ordered a brand new handle for the inside too, but just never put it on because when he had the vehicle, he just drove on the pass on the driver's side. Uh, very rarely did anybody ever ride with him, so he just never found the time to put it on. So, luckily, I didn't have to order it. I had a brand new handle ready to go. Uh, so, that's that on that. Um, this is the one that was broken. And I also have a brand new I don't know why well, no it says not brand new I think he might have got this one from the junkyard but it has a lock mechanism but it doesn't have a handle itself this is for the driver's side so I got an extra piece with the lock mechanism but just not the handle itself so anyway got all that together figured out what was going on how to fix it 
uh, swap this out, put the brand new, all this is brand new right here, put the ribbon in there like it was supposed to be on the right way. And now, all they left to do is put the door panel back on. Now, this is not a how-to video by any means. There's a ton of how-to videos already out there on this make and model of, uh, I said this body style of Tahoe's, four doors, two doors, this body style and this in general. I actually went to look to a lot of them videos and to see, you know, what's what and how to do all this. So I'm not trying to do a how-to video. This just give you an update of what's going on. These vehicles, GMV, any GM vehicles really in particular from the 80s to the 90s, is notorious for these little plastic clips uh, breaking off. They never come off like they're really supposed to. So, what happened is, let me show you over here, if I can reach it. Now, these door panels, these inside door panels have been taken, or these inside, yeah, the inside door panels have been taken on and off multiple times. So a lot of the clips are broken. A lot of the clips are cracked in bad shape. What I did right here, it got, it got these brand new clips I ordered off of Amazon. So I got these clips off of Amazon right here. This would be the one I grabbed. The broken one I already broke. All right. Take two. I ordered these brand new clips right here off of Amazon. I'm sorry. I ordered a package of these brand new clips off of eBay. These were cheap. They were like, basically, you get 20 clips for $5. And this is the company. I got them off of eBay. $5 and change for each door. So, you know, it's a pretty good deal in my opinion. One package does one door. It's a pretty good deal. If you got this kind of any GM vehicle, buy new clips. Don't even waste time trying to use the old ones. You're talking about a vehicle, 20 plus year, a 20 almost 20 year old vehicle. Uh, the panels have been off, off and on numerous times. What's $5, you know? So, got the brand new clips. Pop that door panel on the driver's side. That door panel is solid, more steadier than it's ever been since I've had the vehicle. So there you have it. That's the update. Um, I'm just doing get this door, this door situated. You know, the door situation. Get that taken care of. Once I get the door panel back on, eventually I will start driving this car a little bit more. I haven't really been driving it lately. I've just been riding my motorcycles, but. I just been kind of piddling with it a little bit at a time here and there. Nothing major. All right, people, I'm not gonna try to make this too crazy long of a video. I just let you know what's going on, what's happening with the 1999 two-door Tahoe. Back in action as far as the door-wise. Both windows roll up and down, no problem. Both doors, handles work inside and outside, no problem. And the electric locks work with no problem. And that's kind of, a, I'm starting to realize from reading a lot of forums and stuff on information on these vehicles, that's kind of a rare thing. So, but luckily for me, it's not really hard to find. It's such a common problem that this stuff breaks. It's easy to find these parts. So there you have it. Quick update of the 1999 two-door Chevy Tahoe. All right, people. Thanks for watching Hunter Spoke Riders. Subscribe today to not miss a video.
You want to hit that little bell like so? Easy. Don't forget about the notifications. All you got to do is go up there and click it just like that. Slide on down there, hit that save button, and then you won't miss a video. It's that easy.